Jurassic Room. Guys, and welcome to Jurassic Room. Let's check out, well, real, not a reaction video. We're doing another Jurassic Chat. I believe this should be 31, I believe. Uh, I, I gotta check if I'm right. Yep, 31. So, and also, guys, we've nearly hit the, four, the 500 subscriber mark. We're at 496 subs so far. So, we're almost there. Just got done feeding the catfish, so they're looking pretty good. Ah, uh, but let's see. So, first up in the news, if you haven't already heard, Trevorrow is out for episode 9. However, I do not remember quite uh, what he, why he stepped out. I never really thought he'd be the the right director for Star Wars anyway. I, th I think he has, a, he has a specific style, and I think it's uh, better off, personally. Uh, but I'm really glad that he's still on for Jurassic World 2 with Jay Abiona. And I hope that they continue to work together, possibly for the third movie, Jurassic World 3, and figure out how that will work out. But we've also got some news that there will be 10 LEGO sets. This reported from LEGO. It says here, there will be 10 LEGO sets based on all the movies for the 20th anniversary, 25th anniversary, sorry. So that's really cool. And two Duplo sets that are all set to come out in April. So, a Duplo set is basically a little bigger blocks, but 10 sets, that's way more than the 5 we got for the first movie. If you don't know the other ones that we got for the first movie, we had the Velociraptor, two different Velociraptor sets, a Dilophosaurus Ambush, T-Rex, uh, Chase set, and the Indominus Rex Breakdown. Oh, 6 actually, we also have the Tranodon set. So, we had 6 sets, so that's really cool we're going to get 10 sets all together for this film. I imagine it's going to be way bigger in scale and gonna be a lot more animals then let's see other than that we got the biggest set of news that come out so far we got some awesome an awesome photo of different stuff that's gonna be coming out like merchandising as food we got different marshmallows with uh, or different foods with the pictures of dinosaurs mainly I think stegosaurus we got Rexy of course Rexy looks awesome on this on the front of these uh, uh, these Images, sorry, that came out very wrong. Kind of a new look compared to the regular T-Rex that we usually, see, the regular Rexy image we see on almost everything. So it's really cool to see a new image of Rexy. Then of course we see Blue, uh, and that she's coming back definitely. She's got a better, uh, a bigger role apparently. So she'll be coming back for this film. Sorry, I'm really losing my mind here. And then we see other dinosaurs like Triceratops in the in the pictures and they look really good. I really liked how the Triceratops looks. And we got them we got these for chicken nuggets, uh chips, it looks like popcorn, uh cereal. I see it's Kellogg's on there, so probably frosted flakes or something. And uh marshmallows we see Rexy on. So that's really pretty cool. <coughs> pretty cool. But other than that we have not gotten very much uh, information so far about anything uh, yet to come, except for a tweet from Danielle Panita uh, saying that she's dur she's been seeing a couple scenes, it's on uh, tw on uh, Instagram and all that, so I can't really pull it up for you right now, but basically she's saying that she's seen some pretty big scenes and everyone else looks pretty sexy in the scenes, so that's pretty cool, they're talking to Jay Abiona, seeing how the film's coming together, so it's really cool to see how the film is coming together so far. And as for, I know everyone's been talking about when are we going to see the game, or the the trailer, when are we going to see our scene, the toys come out, and I figured I'd go ahead and turn that out in this video. I'm going to make another video, though, on when we can see different trailers for different movies that we've been waiting so long to see for, like uh, The Predator and Meg, and that's for another video. But frankly, I think that if we're, we're going to get a, a teaser, a teaser, I think they're going to set it up the same way as the last time, and we're probably the... Latest and earliest will be most likely November or December, I think, because we're definitely gonna have stuff for like the C the the Super Bowls. Gonna, there's gonna have, definitely gonna be a Super Bowl TV spot. I imagine the first trailer will be out sometime in January or so, January or February, and then of course from there on, because the film's coming out June 26th, I, I believe. Yeah, but. As for the toys, it's really difficult. The Lego sets are coming out in April, so I imagine around the same time we'll be getting the, um, check out Caesar. I imagine at the same time we'll be getting all the other toys. So I imagine the first images should come out around, around November to December, because we'll definitely probably see at least the first real good looks at these toys, probably in February, 
because of the New York Toy Fair. I believe that's in February. Yeah. But I imagine that'll be the first time we get a good look at these toys. And, of course, they'll be out two months later and uh, being ready for the film. So what do you think, guys? What do you think of all this new information? What do you think of my uh, opinion about the teaser and the toys? Cannot wait to see all this stuff come out. Oh, oh there we go. Yeah, and we just knocked over Punisher, too. I got a little setup here. As you can see, it's a little messed up. We got my phone. Got the extra pieces of different toys here. We got NECA. We got Walking Dead. Uh, Marvel Legends. We got the Marvel Legends uh, man thing here. We got all the, you know, we got Bullseye knocked over here. We got Punisher that just got knocked over. Got my earphones. Got this picture I drew of, uh, well, really, it was just a color drawing of a leopard, and I drew it in. And I drew in the, the background because it was very boring. And I love how I did the eyes, though. The green on the eyes. But anyway, we got my clay dude, and then we got the information here. Got a little good setup here. We got the catfish out right now. You can see uh, Will's out, so it's pretty cool to see them out. We got to uh, siphon out this tank though. It's really dirty. Well, we can see we got Salazar and Will back there, so that's pretty cool to see them both out. I think they've been kind of had a little run for their money though, because the little electric catfish has kind of taken over the castle again. Uh, again so... Got to figure out what to do with these guys. I want to put in a few more things so they can better hide, have more areas to get away from him. This is kind of being a little jerk because he's actually chased Will out around a little bit. So there's Will. Hey guys, just fed him some chicken too, so they're doing pretty good. And we got the turtle here. We got the turtle, turtle, turtle. How you doing, big guy? Guy, siphon your tank out too. Tomorrow's Friday. He's so cool. He's a little turtle. Of course, we got Caesar down here. Maybe we'll check on the guys real quick. Let's see. Uh, we got Oracle right here. There's my girl. There's Oracle. I think we can see her. Uh, there we go. There's Oracle. Here we go, girl. And we got Caesar here. Hey, big boy. Yeah, you got an old piece of lettuce. Got to clear out the old lettuce. Hey, big guy. How you doing, big guy? Ready for a bath soon? And we got Nira down here. It's a little dark in her tank right now, but she's all coiled up right there. Uh, let's see. We got Pokey right here. We got Pokey. Hey, Pokey. Hey, girl. So we'll get the 12 hours form right now, and then turn back on the lights in the morning. So everyone's doing pretty good. Got to clean up tanks tomorrow. Uh, but I think that's about it, guys. I think it covers everything. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's hit the 500 subscriber mark because we're only a few subs away. And we'll see if we can do some other videos tonight. So let's hit that subscriber mark, and thanks for watching. <laughs>